Hey guys, and welcome back to Kerbal Space Program. This is our first actual mission. The last episode was just us uh, basically deciding what mission to go for. And I think we can all agree that I should probably start out with something simple. So, we started out with trying to launch a satellite into orbit. That way our Kerbals can have GPS and stuff like that, right? So this is our satellite design here that I'm building. And I did speed up the footage a little bit because it kind of took a little while to build in a couple different uh, phases. So we have this kind of uh, radial top up there with the dish for the uh, antenna basically. And then on the sides we have the two solar panels that are going to extend once we get into orbit. And then those striped yellow canisters is fuel for our RCS thrusters which will help us... Uh, basically realign ourselves once we get out into space. So that's the basic design for the satellite. Now I'm building the rest of the rocket that's basically going to get us into space. And this mission was actually a little bit harder than I thought. I was thinking it wouldn't be all that difficult to get into orbit. But as a newbie to this game, it actually was kind of difficult. So. This is actually my fourth or fifth design. I had a couple other designs going, but they all failed miserably and basically blew up on the launch pad. So this one actually showed some promise, and I won't spoil anything whether it worked or not. So we've got these big old rockets of fuel and engines on the bottom, and of course our aerodyna aerodynamic caps to make sure we get off the launch pad. and. It's kind of funny, we're using so many rockets for such a small thing. I'm not sure, I probably could have built uh, with less, but like I said, I'm still trying to get the hang of things. So, we're going to connect it with struts just to make sure it's stable, not wobbling, and we are ready for launch, which we are pretty center aligned, and what I mean by that, we're not wobbling all over the place, we're not spinning, we're kind of spinning, but we're not... Uh, rocking back and forth or anything. Our center of mass is towards the center of our ship, which is definitely good. And basically, we are trying to get into orbit, so we gotta leave the atmosphere and start to uh, spin kinda out of control here, but we'll eject our rest of our pods and keep heading up, and we're able to correct ourselves and start leaning um, for our sideways ascent into orbit. So most of my ships actually didn't get past this phase, which is kind of sad to say. Uh, and if they did, I was like almost out of fuel. But this one actually made it up here, so we're just making sure that we correct ourselves, uh, stay heading in the right direction, and we're basically just going to be trying to get into orbit from this position. Uh, if you haven't played this game, that blue line right there on the map is basically showing us our orbit. So right now, we're the way that we're going is we're pretty much going to rebound all the way back into the ocean. So we got to go out a quite a ways farther in order to get into orbit without being sucked back in by gravity. So got to conserve some fuel and just keep heading straight out almost at a 90 degree angle so that we can get into orbit with Kerbin. And now we're getting kind of close. We're almost there. And pretty soon we're going to be out of fuel on this stage. So I was getting a little antsy right here. But luckily we had enough fuel to make it so that we aren't going to redirect back into Kerbin. And now that orbit is not very pretty. Let's see if I uh, brought up the map again. I can't remember. We do have a little bit of fuel on this stage right here. Just trying to get into a better orbit. And unfortunately, I check my map and then I start spinning out of control. <laughs> and so we correct that. And I actually did not go at the correct angle. So unfortunately, we are headed out towards the moon. But we are kind of in orbit, right? Eh, well, not really. So, we are basically just heading out to the moon. I don't, 
I probably could have uh, corrected myself here, but I wasn't quite sure uh, what to do about that. So we uh, basically, in a second here, I believe we are going to run out of fuel, and then we can extend our solar panels, extend our antenna, and see what our our cool looking little GPS satellite actually looks like. And for some reason, every time I was checking my map, I was just spinning out of control. Don't know what was up with that. As you can see here, I am trying to redirect, trying to get back into orbit. But it didn't really work, so I decided to just eject because we were out of fuel. And our debris is going to orbit, but we aren't. But that's okay. Let's just extend those panels. And look at our beautiful satellite. So the Kerbals will have GPS for a little while until our satellite decides to fly towards the moon, but I think it's a nice looking little satellite. Not too bad. And then I decided to just see, hey, where are we going to end up if I just fast forward everything? So I time warped ahead, basically just to see what would happen. So I thought we were going to run into the moon. But we basically got into the gravitational pull of the moon, and then it slingshotted us out past the moon. So here you can see me trying to make sure we're not going to run into the moon. And we're going to go past it. And then I was trying to use my RCS thrusters basically to, to get into orbit of the moon. And maybe figured we could have like a lunar satellite or something. But that didn't quite work out. They aren't very powerful. They're mainly just to readjust. And for docking and stuff like that. If you're trying to piece together a space shuttle. Or a space station rather. So that didn't really work. So I decided to fast forward some more. Figure out what happened. And we actually got into orbit. Of course we were in orbit around the sun. And not around Kerbin. But hey. We're still in orbit right? We didn't specify what we had to be in orbit around. And hopefully I don't run into any of these planets or anything, but for now we are up there and we are circling the sun with our satellite. So that is our first mission for Kerbal Space Program. So what should we do next? Let me know. I'm thinking we can try to send a rover to, to the moon, or we can try and start building space station. Uh, basically, we'll just build a core and then we'll put the other pieces up. But either way, let me know in the comments below. And I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you guys again soon. Thanks for watching.